Hi guys, my name is Valerie from Valerie Visuals. I'm an illustrator, graphic and motion designer. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to create this funny character and we're gonna concentrate mostly on how to create these green texture shadings. Okay, first choose a color for the background and then drag the color on the canvas. Then go to action, canvas and choose drawing guide. Now choose a brighter color, create a new layer, go to brush library, inking and then choose technical pen. Now draw a circle and don't leave the pen from the canvas. Now press with two fingers on the canvas, adjust the size of the circle and now you can leave the pen and your two fingers. This is how we create a symmetric bow. Now go to transforms and press on fit to screen. It's going to help us to align the ball exactly in the middle. Now let's resize it with two fingers. Cool. Now drag the color into the ball. Let's turn off the guide. Go to brush library. Go to touch ups and choose the noise brush. Now choose a brighter color and let's create a highlight for the ball. As you can see, the color is go over our ball. We don't want that. Tap the screen with two fingers to undo and let's make it in the right way. Go to layers, press on the ball layer and activate alpha lock. And now, no matter where you're painting, it's going to paint only in the boundaries of the ball. Very nice. Now let's choose a darker color for the shading. Looking kind of nice. And for giving the 3D look, let's take a brighter color, reduce the side of the brush and start to paint here in the edge. Now you can deactivate the alpha lock. Now let's create the eyes. Make new layer, choose white color, bring the technical pen brush from brush library and draw a symmetric ball like we created the previous ball. Drag the color on the ball, go to transforms and press on the fit to screen. Now let's resize it with two fingers. And now let's activate the alpha lock for creating the shading for the eye. Choose darker color, then bring the noise brush, reduce the size of the brush and start painting for a little bit of 3D look here too. And now create the eyeball. Repeat the same process like previous balls. A little highlight for the eyeball. Make sure you create this highlight on the new layer so you can move it separately in the right position.
Now let's merge our all eye layers by dragging the three layers into the middle. Cool. Let's make him another eye. First bring back the drawing guide, place the eye in the good position, swipe with one finger on the eye layer and press on duplicate. Now with the transform tool bring the eye to the left side. Next let's create the mouth. Make new layer. Draw a straight line, don't leave the pen from the canvas yet, adjust the length and only then release the pen from the canvas. Same technique for the arm. Now let's create teeth and tongue with the help of alpha lock. Activate alpha lock on this layer and draw a symmetric rectangle for the teeth And for the tongue choose red color and draw a little arc like that. And add a little shading on these areas. Now make a new layer and let's create a little shading for the mouth. Press on this icon for bringing the eyedropper. Now bring this circle to the color that we want to sample. Now choose darken color of this color. Bring back the noise brush. And start to painting this area. We need more darker color. Let's undo. Okay, this is better. Now, with white color, create a little highlight. Look nice. Now, let's create a cool texture for our character. Duplicate the main ball layer, activate the alpha lock, we don't need the guide for that. Now go to the brush library and find a tessellated brush. Choose a little bit darker color and start to paint over the old ball. Now we're going to create a cool glow effect for the eyes. Merge the layers. Merge the main balls. Duplicate the layer. Go to adjustments. Go to hue saturation and bring the brightness to 100%. Press and hold the V icon for showing only this layer. Now go to adjustments again and choose Gaussian Blur. Adjust the blurness level and now if we bring all layers back, you can see now we have this cool glow effect. Add to it a little bit noise. Like that. Now we can create a background with the noise brush. Make new layer. Choose the color that you want. Bring the noise brush and start to paint.
Let's add another color. Merge the background layers and for the final touch let's create a cool glowing shadow by duplicating the blue ball layer. Now let's turn all of the layers by pressing long touch on the V icon and bring the brightness to 0%. Now adjust the Gaussian blur. Move a little bit this layer to this area. Then duplicate this layer and bring the brightness for this layer to 100%. Finally, merge these layers and press on the N icon, then choose Overlay. That's it guys, this is what I created with this illustration in After Effects. If you want to learn how to create these cool animations in After Effects, you should definitely check my other tutorials about After Effects. And if you find this tutorial helpful, subscribe to my channel for more cool tutorials in the future. See you next time.